Welcome back to Let's Play Make Adventure Neptunia V2R. My name is Karsten. I where the party's at. I did do some stuff off screen. I uh, basically went through and got all the hidden treasure for everything that is not in uh, Lean Box. Obviously, I couldn't do anything in Lean Box yet because we're going to hit a cutscene as soon as we start heading in that direction. But I got all the hidden treasure of everything else. Uh, consequently, I did end up leveling a bit. Because some of the hidden treasure requirements were things like defeat all enemies on the map. So everyone but Rom and Ram are just over 50 now. Uh, it wasn't really trying to power level, it just kind of happened. Uh, not really doing a uh, grind for levels so much as just trying to get 100% items. <laughs> and uh, that just kind of happened as a consequence of that. I did rearrange who's up front here because uh, these ones are fragile and tend to die if we, end we run into a strong enemy, which happened a couple times. I did find out that on the uh, maps where you have to defeat all enemies, the strong enemies don't count uh, as required. I think they do reduce the count of how many you do need to beat, but you don't have to beat them. Uh, you can just defeat all the regular enemies, and that will end up uh, being enough. Which is good, because some of those strong enemies are stupidly strong. Most of them are okay, and all of them I was able to survive at least long enough to run away. But, in any case. I also, uh, went through and picked up ev everyone's skills, except attack skills. Uh, you know, regular standard attack skills. But all the special skills, all the item skills, all the lily skills, I've Went ahead and bought all those for all the current party members, though there are going to be a couple more party members joining soon, of course. So let's go ahead and head off and uh, meet up with uh, Vert and Gear. Uh, can't we just hang out here? It's the ocean. Yep, the ocean. All ships and planes are still cancelled, aren't they? Yep, still cancelled. Well, you're up, Nep. Let's get a move on. I never imagined I'd have to cross an ocean carrying two people. I hope I don't drop anyone. And we are going to hit lean box first before we get to any of those other places. Wait a minute, I'm going to have to go back and do that again in a sec. Here we are at Leanbox. It's been quite a while since I've been here. Let's see, Vert is... <sighs> what? Who is that weird person? Oh, I haven't seen your faces around here. I see you've come to see my neck muscles. Then by all means, look to your heart's content. Now, now, Gooman. You shouldn't shock these girls too much. Another weird person appeared! There's no way such cute girls would have any interest in men's muscles. I'm sure they've come to see my nice body and take notes. Or eek! Huh? Neptune? Oh, this voice! My dearest younger sibling, Nepgear! Neptune, you came to pick me up! That's right, Neptunior! Now, come, leap into your sister's arms! Okay! Not so fast. What the- Vert? Don't put a damper on our sentimental sisterly reunion! Sisterly? How strange! I was most sure that Nepgear was my sister! Even if she was your sister, 
Who was it that immediately sent her away, despite having finally been reunited with her? Ugh. No fighting you two. Here, feast your eyes upon my deltoids. They have been known to unify entire countries. They will surely patch this up. No, no, my waist is much more suited to help them reconcile. Look at my swaying. Want out of this party? Two strike. Current hardware. Oh, man. Burn. <laughs> Dark Vita. Beam Sword Max Output. Acutus. Alright, now let's see. We can't do that. Thing here yet. Mm. Now let's see. I think what I will do. Sorry, I uh. And. Sorry, Yenny. And sorry, Compa. to let them all trickle in yet. Okay, now what are the requirements for here? See if any of them are easy. Uh, defeat Valentine's five times in a row. Huh? Doesn't show... Oh, so the... Treasure box has appeared, but I haven't gathered it yet. I gathered all of them anyway. That one I have. This place looks pretty wild. And five times without healing, and I haven't gotten everything. Well, I'll I'll come back to those. Yeah, the energy mate, when there's uh, multiple areas within an area, multiple sub-areas, uh, when, uh, when you get the hidden treasure, usually a treasure appears in each of the sub-areas. Although sometimes if there's a special boss area, it doesn't appear there. And one of them will have the actual item and the others will have more energy mates is what seems to be what's happened there. Presumably there will be a way for me to get more energy mates later because otherwise there won't be a way to level up all the scouts all the way. Okay, so I think... Let's see, if we go across here... here... Yep, she does... She transforms as we go across there. All right, let's get back here. Let's try going here. And continue the plot. Whew, I'm tired. Wait a minute, was there more converse things over here? I didn't look. I choose you. I'm home. No, there's not. Surprisingly, no one to talk to. Wow. All right, well let's head over here and quit dragon. And continue let's on with the plot. Going here. What is this? 
In a certain online encyclopedia, Neptune's entry has been vandalized. Quite bold. Her pictures become one of a macho man with a three-pronged spear as well. Neptune, the evil pudding god from the pudding planet. She's used the national budget to buy tons of luxury pudding worldwide. And the base of Neptral Tower is built from the empty cases. She puts pudding on the end of all of her sentences. They're not wrong about her liking pudding, but their spiteful writing is awful. There are far too many strange parts. I'm not sure there was ill will, but... Even though an online encyclopedia that is editable by anyone is lacking in credibility, most of the nation's people will see this. We must restore it as soon as possible. Then please leave it to me. I had a whole bunch of good points about Neptune. Please wait, Nepgear. That's a problem in and of itself. Lady Neptune's page got trolled hard. Top Keck. BTW, Nepnoa is dead. There. <laughs> this should be good for the blog today. Hmm, looks like the encyclopedia entry I've analyzed has just been updated. It's time to start the edit war. Hmm? This is strange. Far from fixing the entry, just a creepy amount of addendum is defending the CPU. She's happy-go-lucky, but she gets things done when it counts. Her face when she eats pudding is the cutest in the world. Citation needed, pleb. There. Nipgear. A dictionary's commentary is one to be based on fact, and... I'm sorry, I didn't erase it, but it really is the truth. I'm home. Hmm? What's wrong, you two? Seems she herself is not bothered by it. Not even realized. I will return the entry to yesterday's state and place a lock on editing it. Ah, uh, edit wars. Neptune, Noir, Blonde, Burt, Nepgear, Uni, Rom, and Ram. Finally, the day has arrived when we are all able to gather together. Despite the pleasant reunion, our situation is dire. Ever since game industry changed, it has been mired in chaos because of FMX. Yeah, we've been made aware of that back home as well. When I interrogated the captured order members, they told us everything. They didn't know anyone by name, but the world was changed because of a certain few. These same people had been advising the order. It was the same in Louis. The captured revolutionaries said something similar. In order for the revolutionaries to control Louis, they had Affimax rewrite history and made it seem like Louis had always utilized the license system. They didn't name any names either. Goodness, it was the same for you two? Did you experience this as well, Lady Bird? Yes, members of Affimax had been lending Esha a hand so she could fulfill her objective. I, however, was able to learn the names of a few of its members, one being R4, the other being the big Neptune we met in Zero Dimension. No way! My other self was actually a member of the secret organization? Even if she isn't the proper protagonist, she's still a Neptune! Man, oh man, oh man, I know this series has had some over-the-top moments so far, and he never expected another dimension's me to be the enemy. So currently, if we exclude Warichu, it's clear the members of the organization are the Ninja Steamax, R4, the other Neptune, and a mysterious unidentified girl. But I cannot believe that is all of them. And to continue, it is certain that this group was involved in the world's reorganization. But how will we launch an attack on them? Have you already found them? Yes. A skilled hacker acquaintance of mine happened to be visiting this dimension and helped me identify their location. Ugh, what is it that I have a really bad feeling about this? It must be that person. As long as the opponent's forces are unknown for this plan, 
the CPUs and CPU candidates along with IF and COMPA, all ten persons must infiltrate the aerial battleship, their base of operations. Remember, the enemy is an organization capable of recreating the world. Please be careful. I snuck inside to obtain some material for the general site. But this is quite alarming. I must hurry back and inform the general. You thought we'd left? Nope, we're still here. He is this word? Really pushy. He has to head out as soon as we arrive here. The situation is indeed dire. It's only expected. Hey, Gold Third wasn't always Gold Third, right? Weren't they all strangers before? They heard about that from Sisha. Supposedly, Bisha found an NMR magazine in the park, which has an article about world destruction. Of course, everyone besides Bisha didn't believe the prophecy, but shortly after, the Golden Summits appeared. Having read the prophecy, all four panicked. They scaled the summits to save the world and ended up receiving the Golden Power. Afterwards, since they'd just obtained the power, they wanted to test how strong they were, and they interrupted our match. Ah, so that is their story. It was quite a blessing in disguise that it was those four who bore no ill intentions. By the way, the world has been reorganized, but are there any changes to yourselves? Shares have gone down somewhat, but there's no change to speak of otherwise. Everything's about the same for me, too. Lon has... Oh, how unfortunate. Hmm? It appears Blonde hasn't been... Reorganized... Uh, I can't talk. It appears Blonde hasn't been reorganized in areas where she could have used it. Damn it, Thunder Tits. When will you give this up already? Do I have to murder you? It's been a while since all four of us have met up together like this. Yeah, we went through a lot of trouble. It was a good experience. I was able to meet Keisha, too. And a super amazing experience, too, right, Rom? Uh-huh. Ram and I both became hunters. We were kicking monster butt left and right. Wow, you two are great. Good job. What about you, Nepgear? Me? Well, uh, oh, Uni, could you excuse me for a second? What? You always suddenly just start massaging people's chests. I have a feeling that your chest has gotten a little larger. Did you grow a little? I haven't. Wait, you must have. I remember your size when you transform. You've forgotten that my chest gets smaller when I go HDD, haven't you? That's right, I'm sorry. It's been a while. Why does that only happen to you, Uni? I don't know. That's what I want to know. Then we'll investigate it for you. Ram and I will be the doctors. You need please show us your chest. Alright then. I'll investigate it too. Yeah. Hey, my bath towel. Don't come off so... Don't touch there. Seriously. Ugh. I'm weak there. No, seriously. I'm ridiculous. So stop, please. Now, now, Uni, it's possible you've been affected by the reorganization, so we'll have to investigate thoroughly. I mean, why does this always happen to me? Hmm. This month's sales are ten times last month. If this increase continues, we should be able to pay off the loan for this battleship swiftly. This battleship was purchased on a loan? It would be impossible for an individual to purchase a battleship in one payment. Steamax and I managed to buy this ship after researching it for over a year, and even creating an effective payment plan. Hey, come on, no one wants to hear about real stuff like loans or debts or plans. People are here to play a game, jeez. And how are your plans progressing? <laughs> Listen and be amazed, for all of Game Industry's information is well within my grasp. 
similar sites to ours have been driven to ruin with Steamax creating false scandals about them, and we have a monopoly on advertising fees. I see. Good for you. And what of the retrieval of the items? There have been no shortcomings. We have already gathered all four. If so, then I'll collect them as agreed. Five trillion credits paid in advance. You scum, that wasn't the agreement. Not even going right on the black market for what you got there. I don't think we won't sue you. I fulfilled my promise of retrieving them. However, I never said I would hand them over to you for free. You money-mongering idiot. Why do you say that like it's an insult? The world runs on money. Money is everything. There's no sin in seeking it out. Ugh, we'll just have to take them by force. Neptune. Yes, sir, Arbor. Hmm? Heh, <laughs> this is easy for someone like me. Huh? There's one missing. It appears you've made a mistake. I can never count on you when I need to. Just have to take him on myself. That's as far as you go, Lady R4. I'm not sure what's happening here, but as a ninja who serves under the general, I cannot turn a blind eye. Ooh, ninjas are so cool. Lady R4 and Lady Neptune, and any who point a sword toward the general, I will have them pay for their sin in hell. To think the moody ninja would return now of all times. Neptune, we're calling off playing with these idiots for now. We're returning with what we have. Mm, I kind of wanted to stay together a little longer, but I guess you're the boss. Are you fleeing? Go, warp. So they've escaped. But what is going on, General? Good work, Steemax. There's nothing you need to know of. Again? So, what are the results of your spying? It's actually an emergency. The CPUs have caught onto us and are headed towards this battleship. Hmm, so this time has finally come. However, CPUs without the power of faith are no match for me. Even without relying on R4's lot, I'll capture the CPUs and request a ransom for them. Ha 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 ha! Oh, as expected of you, General. I'll follow you for life. Ridiculous. Follow me for life, you say? Did I say something strange? Steamax, you're fired. What? General, what are you saying? Such a joke is bad for my heart. It is no joke. We've been in a recession as of late. Recession? Even in the, if society is in a recession, you're not profiting, General? Ugh. Don't you nitpick me. A recession is a recession. And haven't you found a path that is not aligned with my school of busty blondes? Um, that is, well, not only are you walking a path exactly opposite of the way of busty blondes, but you've become infatuated with a real girl. That's, that isn't... Surely this is worth certain death. Cut your own stomach or leave. Choose whichever you wish. But I believed in you, General. <laughs> so, he's gone. I apologize, Steamax. Now that the CPUs have learned of our existence, all I can do is release you. Even I am no match for them. Besides, not make you fight the person you have feelings for. I even knew you were calling yourself the Gentleman Thief Chiro in front of that girl. Live long in my stead as the Gentleman Thief Chiro instead of the Ninja Steamax. Girlfriend, huh? Even just once, I would have liked one. So oh, very sad, Ephemogus. I'm sad as well to think you would betray me. Hmm. So it's you. I can still forgive you even after all of this. Go and hand that over to R4 immediately. I refuse. I obtained this myself. There's nothing wrong with me selling it to those who want it. 
Have you gotten too obsessed with your affiliates and become a demon of money? Or are you merely acting that way? But this is troubling. As you can see, I have no reality here. So I can't even touch anything. At this rate, the CPUs will take back what you worked so hard to steal. Then I suppose you'll just have to protect it to make sure it won't be taken. Well, that's some heavy plot there going on. We got more new enemies. There. Wait, here. Uh... Get stronger enemies there. Oh, I did want to check because the next plot segment may be longer than the amount of time I want to have for this episode. Um, what I did want to check is I got a. Oh, the. I got a bunch of refining things to make metal plates now. Makes making unit parts easier. Um, I wanted to see, I got, uh, yeah, see, I, I got some things for the, for some of the old third there. I got, uh, these, which presumably are for nep gear. Let's see what they need. Synthetic resin, I think I can buy. So I need to buy 14 more synthetic resin and make two pink and two purple in order to make both of those. I go here. Buy 14 more synthetic resin. Make two pink. Two purple. Then I could go down and make both of those uh, Nepgear dev things. Eventually, I'm probably going to want to make all this stuff. Okay, so those... They do have different stats. Now, let's see... Go here. You have a better uh, weapon for you. How is it? I think this one. Well. Hmm. Slightly less defense. You get more credits, though. And right now, she's probably going to be in the back row. So, Goodness. we'll do that. Like it. And we'll see if the uh, plus 10% credits affect... We get that even if we're in the back row. I also will need to take a check on these and see if... Um, We get XP when we're not in the active party. But for right now, we will continue on with the plot later. I hope you have been enjoying. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.